All right, everyone, welcome. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, yes, I am wearing a Hogwarts t-shirt, very appropriate, for what we are actually going to be watching and what I am actually going to be breaking down in each section. Yes, I do have closed captions on for everyone who actually actually is watching. Uh, maybe not. Um, you can watch this video. This um, I like to thank Hogwarts Legacy YouTube channel for releasing this video six to seven months ago. Uh, we are watching in 1080p, though. If I want 4K, uh, the frame rate on my OBS would not actually handle it. Wait, let's continue, shall we? Oh, let's just fast forward a bit. I do have my notes to my right. Uh, we do hear Loomis as the first spell. We do get to see the cloak and the emblem. And our first render of Hogwarts, and we can see a bridge from Harry Potter and the Prince of Azkaban. The greenhouse one and two are here. Uh, we've got towers. Um, take your guess which one's the astronomy tower. Like, literally take a guess. We have centaurs. We also had a student. We have another student from Gryffindor. Uh, this one is actually particularly interesting. You get to save a hippogriff, and she actually takes the um, evidence of the purchase. We have a troll in armor. That is the, let me consult my notes, the Hebridian Black Dragon. And there's also a student companion from the Centaur Encounter. And you're probably all wondering what this is. This is a grap horn. Yep, this is a grap horn. Just consolidate my notes, and yep, yeah, it is a grap horn. Logo, very well done. I actually like this. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. You can watch this video via Hogwarts Legacy. So we have... Greenhouse 1 and 2, <clears throat> excuse me, mm. that's better, we have the Allery, then we have an area that we can actually find a few things around, the Black Lake, if you actually know your Hogwarts very well, you will actually understand that the boathouse is down behind there. And first, you just actually follow up the stairs to go to the Welcome Great Hall. To Again, we have the bridge from Harry Potter and the Prince of Azkaban. We also have a, another courtyard here. It's connected to it. You're a new student at the, the Hogwarts houses, we've got Slytherin, Gryffindor in red, Slytherin's green and silver. Gryffindor is golden red. Hufflepuff is gold and black. Ravenclaw is blue and silver. Though, I don't know why people who actually do make stuff on Etsy and such go, oh no, it's blue and... It's blue and grey. It's blue and silver. Get it right, please. This is a... Ancient magic... Trick. And looks like we're in Gringotts, by the looks of things from the uh, reflection here. Oh, and that is... Elzaya Fig. He is our professor, and yes, we... Yes, our character is from Hufflepuff now, because of the robes. I actually like those robes. Can I have those robes, please? Can someone please make those robes for me? I don't mind getting them made. We also have... Um, different 
portraits or are these portals that we can actually step through? I do I do not know. I don't have the game in front of me to actually know. But these are different locations. Here we have Let me consult my notes. Uh Goblin that works for Ministry of Magic by the looks of things, though it could also be a security guard for Gringotts. We have a Gringotts goblin. And then we have Renwook himself in the middle. I kind of like uh, his shoulder pads, the gauntlets, and whatever he has on his hands. I kind of like those. And yes, that is a Gringotts security goblin. I'm not sure, because that can also mean Ministry of Magic Gringotts security goblin. Yes, we know this courtyard from... Uh, let's see, what was it? Oh yeah, that's right. The Half-Blood Prince. I think. Great Hall, we have the Eagle slash Raven. Or, or, or cross between the two. I'm going to say cross between two because that that is the only way I can actually figure out how it is, the Ravenclaw. Uh, then we have a lion for Gryffindor. I'm guessing we have a snake further back and a badger further back on this video that we actually never see. And by the looks of things, we actually arrived th during dessert. Yeah, we arrived during dessert because those there they look like lollipops mm. nope yep dessert because uh we do have a thing here from uh book six what's like on you must you must the the uh, we can have uh, a witch or wizard have a werewolf claw mark down one side. Never in a taunt to anyone? Sorting hat. Okay, we have he cat and we have. You're probably wondering why I said he. This is he cat because this is actually our defense against the dark arts teacher. And we have everyone running. The potions, the, not the potions master, the charms master in the background there. So we have the Gryffindor dormitory. I hate those stripes on the full post bed. Ravenclaw, common room, and also the scarf. And that's actually pretty nice for a Ravenclaw. I like that. Though the hemming on the end should actually be silver. Same with that yellow patch. That should be silver. These, the tassels and such, the cords, they should be silver. If anyone doesn't believe me, please look up Ravenclaw's colours for Hogwarts. We have the Slytherin common room, if anyone is actually interested. Uh, I do kind of like the colour on the inside of the ropes. It's a lot more better. Here we have the Gryffindor common room. No, we do not see that uh, that um, cabinet anywhere in the Harry Potter films. And such. The suits of armour do move. The portraits do move. Can we have those house banners, please? I would love those house banners. Here we have a book with, a sp with spells coming out of it. We have notice board. We have students around something. Uh, students entering and exiting around here. Uh, we got cacti. Table. Um, bit of a trivia here. Um, Hufflepuff member. member. Hangers of Woodcroft founded the famous Wizarding Village of Hogsmeade in the middle 
ages. I'm going to say roughly around about 1020 to 1060 because he was born before that. So he was born, I think, early 900s. So there is a, like, 910, around 1900, yeah, 910s AD. So there is a gap between such things and according to everyone it's like Hogsmeade was established in 1914 that would actually be four years before Hangers of Woodcroft and I'm also going to say there's also a bust of Hangers of Woodcroft on the fourth floor corridor we may see the Fat Friar in the Dominum room, common room and such like I said they actually do move, and this bird cage here, this or this owl cage, I should say, actually looks like one of the, the um, <laughs> helmets. And here we have the charms classroom, as, and I'm pausing here because a, if you see where the mouse pointer is above that, that is all the charms and spells for that we are going to be learning. Like Lacarum Informati, Relacio Glacio. This is Reckless Senpar, Aloha Mora, Nox, Loomis, Protego, Herbus, Herbus Totalis, Curvus, Ivius. This is not like the um, Hogwarts herbology we know from Chamber of Secrets. Uh, that is Venomous Tentacular. We also have this, I'm going to say this would probably be a fast travel marker connected to the flu network. That's my guess for this thing here. Um, we do have an area down there that we can go to. Uh, we do have doors for here. Uh, unidentified. Herbology professor and head of Hufflepuff, Hufflepuff House in the 1890s. This, like I said, is Arian Ronan. Yes, I'm consulting my notes. And also, I like to point out that we actually have a bestio. A bestio or something. That's a, that's a spell right there. We have Nox, we have Protego. Here's more spells. More on these two. Imobius. Procorius. Procorium. Reparo. Mobilius. Expecto Patronum. So we are actually getting a Patronus in here. Taylor Loomis. Victorium Locomota, Lurians, Esli, Rathlerio, and that is another one I do not know. Ah, uh, Agamenti. Yeah, Agamenti. Reveal Mugalum. Everyone says, oh, we got some new spells. We got sneak peek of new spells. No. We didn't get sneak peek at new spells because those spells are actually already in this official gameplay reveal trailer. And, of course, we have Quietus, um, Regardium Leviosa, and Expelliarmus. Also ridiculous. And there's more spells over here, including Nox. And there's spells along here. And here. I am confident. You will take hold with a flash and rigorous requisition that may challenge. The best way to practice is by duel. Defense against Dark Arts. Really? No offense to any Silver Urns, but. I swear, I don't like him. I don't like him at all. 
But here we have Hell Kit. We have He Kit. Get on my ass. Oh, look, I actually stopped on a good one. We have Ravenclaw, Gryffindor, and Slytherin. Oh, and the thing that your character is actually in front of is a potion station. Potion is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects. We also have uh, Dead Ruins. Yeah, Dead Ruins. We have potion ingredients and such. Potion station, this one would be a double potion station. <laughs> Wigan Well Potion. Potion ingredients. The fat lady brought up, but um I'll just go back here. There is a skeleton down here of another magical creature that we can actually ruby, um, rescue. So do keep that in mind. And like I said, do keep an eye out for Hangers of Woodcraft bust on the 4th floor corridor. <laughs> the portrait zoom in. Listen for the first one as well. That's Akio. As well as challenging puzzles that will and again, magical skill and a clever mark to solve. Portrait's moving. You may even find yourself in a. Uh, let's just uh, go back just a bit. So we actually find a hidden chest. Yeah, this game, official gameplay reveal trailer, is very helpful on hinting to where secrets are. So we have the kitchen. <coughs> Excuse me. Perfect, perfect the uh, prefix buffer. You have 30 seconds down to comment down below what's different. Yeah, I'm waiting for that 30 seconds to actually be up. And I'm consulting my notes while you all comment below within that 30 seconds. Alright, 30 seconds of up. I will reply to you if you actually guess correctly what is different between this prefix bathroom and another prefix bathroom that we actually know. From a certain movie. It's the late 1800s. 1890s, pretty precise, because A, we also have more spells. Lumus. Bombarda. We have Marishi. There's actually a. You can. Confondo. You can. You can virtually go over this whole section along with the other section for Charms Classroom. All the spells that we need to know are within game on the walls. As we can see, see there's Bombarda. Look, up here. Up here. Confundo. Remember, the dark even, oh, excuse me, even on this wall. So those who actually go, oh, we got sneak peek at the spells and such. Look, there's Patego, Ridiculous, Alohomora. Do I need to continue on here? Considering that those who are, oh, we got more, we got more info on spells and such. The spells were already revealed to us in this official gameplay reveal video that is nearly 15, is, uh, 14 minutes and 39 seconds long. Portraits. Oh, here we have Headless 
nearly headless Nick died in... Well, Sir Nicholas, actually, because he likes to be called Sir Nicholas. But we call him nearly headless Nick. Died in 1492. He is the ghost of Gryffindor. We might be able to see the Fat Friar. Because he died... Uh, he was born in 982, so the Fat Friar ghost would actually be around. And looky, looky, she looks like the Grey Lady. I do mean she looks like the Grey Lady, but we do have other ghosts here. Uh, if anyone would like to take a stab at his name, I would actually be appreciating that. Uh, the most boring classroom ever. As you can tell from the students, apart from ah, uh, character, this is uh, let's see, Cuthbert Bins, Professor History of Magic. Uh, Professor Bins died, and he actually got up as a ghost and continued straight to work. And he's been the only ghost employee there ever since. And we can actually grab books from midair with Accio. We can pull things with Accio thanks to Arian Ronan here. We cannot play Quidditch, but we can actually fly on a broom. Devil's Snare! <laughs> I bet everyone who actually picked over this reveal trailer, this reveal gameplay, didn't actually pick up on the Devil's Snare. I'm guessing this is a uh, Slytherin from the way the statue is, and we actually have an item that we can actually grab. As you unravel a dangerous mystery by working alongside the accomplished that is Elazar Fig. Thank you very much. He's a traveling companion. We also have. Uh, let's just uh, go back a bit. We have some news, and we find out that it is Monday, September first, nineteen eighty, issue whatever that number is. This is the Daily Prophet, and that is Red Rock. This looks like Gringotts. By the looks of things, could be Gringotts. It could also be a dungeon. Red Rock. So, go back. Keep an eye out on where R1 actually shows up. Red Eye, which means they're corrupt. We have a chest behind this dark wizard. There's Ragnarok. Ragnarok. This guy is called Victor Rookwood. Another criminal student. Here, here we are with the Elza Fig. Oh. 
we've seen this happen once before. We've seen this in Goblet of Fire. And the Definitely Hollows Part 2 movie. Uh, two certain wizards. Now here's the thing. This trial has been slowed. You dodge. Don't just stand there. Also, would like to point out the uh, the skull masks. These two are the that these three are wearing. Totalis. <coughs> to A pug These are Euphorious. Expelliarmus. Slam with descender. Roast with incendio. Devastate your enemies using various finishes. You can even use the mysterious, powerful magic that professors do not understand to avoid the battle of school. We actually seen that happen in, I think, Crimes of Grindelwald, and when Voldemort picked up the other one. And of... Hey, throw an anvil on an evil wizard or witch. Literally, that that is an anvil. You can throw that. He can again. <clears throat> In addition to clock uh, we do have another magical creature here. Spells. Spells. Requirement, stealth, and core. We do have character, inventory, talents, which is the page we are on. Collection, uh, challenges, map, outpost, quest, and settings. We do have levels. So. And total. Points available. Uh, let me just uh, go back. See, that's not a chest. That's actually her legs. But we do have a chest and chest. Now, Felix Felius's potion actually allows us to see the chest on the map. Talents to upgrade your spells, Stealth, and potions. Talus, Mobulus, Accio, and Incendio, and don't forget to loot. Here's the chest. Um, Kelpie or something? I'm not entirely sure. Buy or craft your own magical gear. We can collect them. Be yeah, appearance as well, along with traits. This is a potion sale station. We have lion, lion fin quills, lion fish quills. We should, I should say. To keep an eye on the timer for everything, including potions. So that was a scientific tea station, tea potion station. 
Those are moonstones. Potion for stone skin. They're eating cabbages. Hello, Mandrake. Oh this is a Nifla. Grip on. Oh, and that good grip on just enjoying a lovable brush. You can play. Those two lines are not suited or recommended for Gryffindor and Hufflepuff. Some abilities may be taught to you by students who become, become your friends. As you develop relationships with these schoolmates, they can accompany you on your journey as your companions. We have Quidditch gear for both Ravenclaw and Hufflepuff. And over time, you'll learn their stories. She gets along with magical creatures. And loves magical beasts, connecting with them more easily than humans. Creatures, not beasts. Unafraid of detention and breaking the rules. Let me just uh go back. Yes, Peeves and the librarian and the bus of said librarian from her youth. Uh, don't know who he is. <laughs> hey, anyone remember this witch? Burn at the stake a uh, number of times, turn the flames into... Enchanted the flames so that they only tickled her? Hmm? Yes, that's a book that we can actually grab with a, with Bacchio. Ah, the Room of Required. Varium, 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 which we can actually unlock. We have Niffler and another statue of some sort. One of the most remarkable secrets of all Excuse me. Oh, that thing that's bouncing up and down, that is your invisibility potion. That is the Venomous Tentacular. That is another area for God knows what. But we can see Gryffindor. That is a Slytherin behind there. Um, we have Fertilizer. That is the room of requirement. Also, we have... Like I said, scientific T-shaped potion station. You can actually put two. That is your potion, your uh, moonstone. That is moonstone. Uh, let me just uh, shut up shop for a bit. Now my time across so dark. And that's me moving a can. So we do actually have other potion stations or scientific tea or tea shaped potion stations that allow us to actually brew free potions at once. You're introduced to this space. We have dinner tea. It's what you need. Mandrake, oh, pardon me. And then provides it for you. Visibility potion. We have Chinese chopping carrot cabbage, which we saw before. Uh, don't ask me about these five seeds. Venomous Tentacular, ready in 25 minutes. Do keep an eye on your timers. 
for you to sow and harvest plants, brew potions, and upgrade your gear. This is also a room of requirement. A helpful house elf named Deke has you discover the variant that allows you to nurture your own menagerie of magical beasts. What is it? So we are. So we. This is Deke. Say hi. Everyone. Say hi to Deke in the comments. In the comments. He'll be your little house elf to actually help. You can freely customize this. Again, we need moonstones to conjure stuff. Kneesel. Yep. That's a kneesel. Uh, if you don't know, Crookshanks from Prisoner of Azkaban is half kneesel. We have a hippogriff, dragon. No, we can actually explore Hogsmeade Station and Hogsmeade itself. So yeah, this is actually missing the establish in 1914, which is actually not true. So we have our book store. Oh, everyone say in the comments, say hi to Pippin, because you're going to be needing him quite a lot for potions, ingredients, recipes, and please make sure that you actually do have the right connects, sickles, and galleons. And our tailor shop. <coughs> Yeah, um, let's, just, let's go back a bit. Uh, where was this, where's this from? Um, early, the early thousands? Like, what is this outfit? Here's Victor Wood, Rockwood again, and we can see behind him, Hufflepuff, Silver, Gryffindor, and Ravenclaw. More posters, uh, this is in Hogsmeade. Hello, Ollivanders. Fine makers of wands. Makers of fine wands established 382 BC. Mm, I'll go with the feet, them. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, we have the boathouse with the stairs that take so long to actually get up there that it, by the time it is actually by the time you get to the great hall as the first year you're ready for bed after the feast and after being sorted uh, this this is clipping this is clipping if you don't know what clipping is in gameplay, it means that it's a texture that has not actually been properly mapped to what it is actually supposed to be mapped to. Hey, um, just a just a little heads up. Anyone remember um? Anyone remember the pole gate? From Spider Man, Marvel Spider Man, remember that? Yeah, let's not have that in the game, shall we? Can we not actually have Puddlegate trending? Potions, where you can actually get your potion ingredients and probably some recipes from. And of course, you can tell by the book here. Magical creature care and other ingredients that you can actually get from there. And missions with which they can use your There's also a collectible behind this wizard. Magical 
Don't ask me what these are. These are corrupted. I have no idea what they are. But there is a chest that we can actually try and get to. These are moon calves. Yep, they're moon calves. Vessels. Yeah, my notes uh, don't have those. Yes, looks like bring out that. That is the inferies. If you don't know what they are, please look them up. We actually have a spell that protects us from water. Goblin. Look, it's the hog's head in. Dragon bone. Here we go. Um, a laser fig. I have me a black dragon. And we are just going to bypass the whole Live the Unwritten Holiday 2022 because A. This is actually being pushed back to Feb 7th. You have the Collector's Edition and the Deluxe Edition, which yours truly does actually have the Deluxe Edition. I missed out on the Collector's Edition because I'm not spending over $500 on the damn thing. The standard edition actually comes out on Feb 10th. So with the collectors and deluxe edition, you have 72 hours early access. With the standard edition, you get it on Feb 10th. You can also buy the Dark Arts pack. There are no microtransactions, nothing. Uh, just get check my notes again. Yep, nothing. Nothing about anything. Uh, all the spells that we actually have seen are actually on the walls of the Charms classroom. So those who go, oh, we got new spells revealed. Yeah, those spells have already been revealed via this. So please, to those who actually go, we know more information and spells and such. Can I actually redirect you to the Hogwarts Legacy State of Play official gameplay reveal? Because that is where all the spells are. You don't believe me. What are these? He. Uh, trying to find that other here. Here. on all the walls here. So thank you for joining me for this 45 minute breakdown and view. <clears throat> like, comment down below. Also hit the bell notification and please do share this video with everyone that actually is waiting for this game because everyone else who goes oh we have like i said if they say we have no new information on spells and such please redirect everyone straight back to this video along with the timestamps that i've just shown 
you'll be able to see every single spell that's actually in the game. And it's every single spell we know of. So anyway, I will see you all in the next video. And please do take care of yourself. Wherever you are.